Hi guys, welcome back. This is going to be a collective read. Okay, so this is for the collective. All right, this may, rest, may not resonate. If it's not yours, if this is not your story, leave it for somebody else who it is for, okay? So this is a general reading. Remember that if it um, hasn't happened yet, it could be happening now or it's going to happen. All right? So take what resonates. Don't try to make something fit that isn't your story, okay? So this is for the collective, all signs and all places for the collective, please, spirit, guys, angel, universe. What's the messages for the collective at this time? What's the messages for the collective at this time, please? What does the collective need to know most at this time? All right, so let's see what spirit has for the collective. What messages the spirit have for the collective at this time? Okay, so this could be a backstory just off the rip. It doesn't have to be. For some of you, this is going to be a backstory. For others, it may not be. But I'm getting, yeah, I'm getting the Six of Cups, one, 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 and the Star card at the bottom of the deck. So I'm getting like somebody here, they really want to, um, there's an energy of somebody here that really wants to reconcile with you, talk with you. I see somebody missing you. They're very nostalgic. They may want to give you flowers here. Somebody may want to reconnect. This could be someone in your family. I'm hearing a sister, but it doesn't have to be, okay? But I definitely feel like somebody wants to reconcile with you. Someone could be bringing you flowers, maybe several flowers. I'm also getting like, someone's getting like a, 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 a lot of like yeah a lot of flowers a lot of bouquet of flowers okay we have the star card it could be dealing with an aquarius but i feel like you're healing or you're or, or something here i'm getting something about water drinking a lot of water is really important to drink a lot of water i feel like it's going to be very beneficial for your skin for those of you who are breaking out i see this water drinking uh, just go on a water cleanse for even a week straight, just drinking a lot of water, maybe like a gallon of water a day. Okay. Or, um, go take a look at my community tab. I posted, um, the type of water that I drink. That's just one of the types, but it has a lot of, um, minerals and electrolytes in it. So I'm getting like somebody needs that. They need to clear their body of toxins. And the way to do that is water. Just go on a water fast. Okay. No sodas, juices, or anything is what spirit is saying. Just simply water. Okay. All right. So let's see what this is. So I see healing. Someone's in the public eye. You could be an astrologer or a healer. You could work with children as well. Some of you could heal children or uh, work work with special needs children is what I'm hearing. But let's see what's coming in for the collective. What is the Six of Cups? So the Ten of Cups. So we're going from the Six to the Ten of Cups. So you seem to be very happy here. Your family is happy. Your children are happy. Or you're happy about something that happened in the past. Okay, yeah, the seven of pentacles. You're really thinking about the past and how you were very happy or maybe how um, this could also be just somebody showing you a lot of affection. Someone's showing you a lot of love and affection that's making you really happy here. Okay, you could be spending time with your family, your kids. I just see you being really happy, really treated very well. Somebody here could be be very generous with you. You could also be given to some kind of charity here or a non-profit profit organization or something like that. Okay. Yeah, we have the uh, judgment and the high priestess. It could be dealing with a Pisces. But I, I really feel like somebody who's wanting to reconcile here with you. Some of you could be, you definitely could be, um, yeah, the star card sticking out. So a lot of you are uh, in the public eye. Okay, the star card came out. Okay, you could be um, um, a, astrologer, Reiki healers. You could be all of this. Everything I'm saying, you could be an astrologer, a Reiki healer, a um, physicist, a, a doctor, a um, um, tarot reader, a spiritualist. I'm getting you're being called to do this. Are you called to do this? Or some of you are being called to do this if you're not doing it. For others of you, this is your calling. You're already doing it. You're a star. You're highly influential. Very healing. Very beautiful here. I'm getting you're very intuitive very connected to source okay i'm getting you're very happy and comfortable in your life you're being uh 
very much taken care of by the universe. Yeah, and I open the deck and I see the King of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups and the Ace of Wands. I'm also getting you're going to meet someone here in the Justice. Yeah, Libra energy. So I'm also getting you're going to meet someone of high influence as well. You could be of high influence and you're going to meet someone as well of high influence. I'm getting there as a, oh, I love the King of Pentacles in this deck. He is just so machismo, so fucking fine. Look at this nigga. He's like dope as fuck in this deck. Okay. Like this is like real life sexy as fuck. This King of Pentacles is sexy, man. And the Nine of Cups, I'm getting you getting what you want. You're very happy. Who, If you're, you know, yeah, I feel like an influx in your pay as well. Money is coming in. You seem to be really, really happy about the outcome of something here. This something you're saying or something that this call that you're getting is making you very happy. Or this judgment that's being passed here. You have the Justice and the Ace of Wands. Who, oh, Whoever this, whoever this um, King of Pentacles is, is that is coming in. Somebody has a very thick and wide and long and hefty. Somebody here, it has. I'm picturing a man, right? This King of Pentacles, very big, large hands, very large phallus, very large. They could be very muscular, very attractive, very well off, a millionaire. This could, if, or just somebody very well off, a business owner. Somebody that runs shit, very respected. Okay. But that came out the middle of the deck. So I'm going to put that back. That's just when I split the deck. But I see, yeah, what's the high priestess and the star? Yeah, the lovers and the justices here. The nine of cups. Okay. So I'm getting this is justice and love. You're meeting someone you're going to be in love with. I'm getting very attracted to, very sexy. Like somebody here is fine as shit. Like somebody, I'm picturing a masculine here. Very, um, prominent nose, um, strong jaw, jawline, somebody that it could be muscular, not overly muscular, but just that like looks very good in their clothes, like um, a chiseled chest, nice, like maybe like an eight pack or something like that, um, muscular legs, pretty feet. I don't know why I'm getting emphasis on feet. Somebody's hands, very large hands, very protective, very loving and caring. Somebody that treats you so well. Okay, yeah, what's the star in the um, high priestess? All right, but I'm getting like a lot of spiritual healing. A lot of healing here is going on. A lot of, yeah, the Ace of Swords. Absolutely, that's the truth. So everything I just said was the truth with the Ace of Swords coming out. I'm getting like, you're very victorious. You're very sharp. I'm getting your mind. It's very, you're clearing your mind. Maybe this water, if you're drinking a lot of water, that could be clearing your mind as well. But I'm getting like you, you're intelligent here. You know the truth. There's also something about your hands. Your hands are very sexy to someone or someone's hands are very sexy to you. Okay. You pick what side of this you, you're on. Okay. But I'm getting you're very intelligent, also very intuitive, very healing. I'm getting you have the, the um, you're able to heal people with your voice. You have a very strong, dominating voice and you're able to heal people with just your voice. I'm getting a very, I'm getting somebody with a very sexy laugh, somebody that's very intelligent, very witty. Okay, but you seem to be very happy here. You're, ve you're I, I just getting you're happy. Yeah, a lot of options here. Okay, what is this? Okay, this, this I just flipped over a whole bunch of fucking cards, man. We saw the Six of Wands, Page of Wands, Four of Cups. So, so definitely uh, good news or yeah, the Eight of Wands. So you definitely could be gaining a following or a lot of um, emails or likes, comments, and subscribes, a lot of shit taken off for you here. This is beautiful energy that I'm getting so far. Very beautiful. I'm getting something about your crystals. A lot of you need to work with your crystals. Carry your crystals with you for healing. You need to. I'm also getting something about clear quartz. A lot of you need to um, carry your clear quartz crystal with you if you have that. Okay. My clear quartz. Oh, it's in the bathroom. Okay, yeah. So look up clear quartz and carry that with you here. What is the messages? 
I'm also getting you're learning something new. This could be something new that you're doing. This could also be somebody wanting to reconcile here with you. Wow, there's that Ace of Wands. A lot of new opportunities. I only have seven cards out and two of them are aces here. So I'm getting like something new here. A lot of healing, a lot of opportunities, a lot of things coming in for you. This, this Ace of Wands, oh my God. Like, yes. It's something about someone's hands, very healing hands. I'm, I'm getting everything you touch turns to gold, very magical. I'm also getting that, that the strength of three of wands. There could be somebody here that's very much wanting. Here's another ace. We have the knight of cups and the ace of pentacles. Somebody's coming in with an offer. Somebody's coming towards you. They're pining after you. I feel like somebody has a lot of fears here with coming towards you. Okay. But I feel like yeah, somebody's undecisive or they're unsure about coming towards you. They're not sure. What is the ace of pentacles? I mean, what is the ace of wands and the ace of swords? I'm getting a lot of new creative ideas. You have a lot of ideas here. You're, you're very creative here. Like your mind just seems to be at an all time like. Hold on, I have the deck in reverse. All right. Yeah, the six of swords. Okay, so moving ahead, your guides, you're being spiritually guided here. Your guides are guiding you into this or, or guiding this new person into your life or you're being guided into this person's life. Let's see what's going on here. But I see things moving ahead slow. I mean, um, um, moving ahead great for you here. Things are moving re really smoothly in your life. You seem to be very happy here. I'm definitely getting, um, uh, yeah, the two of wands, making good choices. You can't go wrong. Making really, whatever these ideas that you're implementing, you cannot go wrong. It's a good choice. It's a good move for you is what I'm hearing. Stop being indecisive of, or on the fence about whatever this decision is you need to make. You could be dealing with an Aquarius or a Pisces for some of you. But I'm definitely getting like, there's someone new here, but there's also somebody here that wants to reconcile something with you. So this King of Pentacles that's coming towards you, they may even be traveling towards you. This is someone new that you just met that you're very passionate about. A lot of chemistry. Um, somebody here has a... Oh, I can't say that enough, baby. Somebody's shit is, yeah. I feel like, um, and then you got somebody here that wants to reconcile with you, that wants to come back in. So we have the Hermit. It could be a Virgo. We have Virgo, Pisces, Aquarius here. And then we, or an Aries, okay? But we have the Magician in the reverse. So somebody here is very manipulative. This could be this person from the past. Someone could be doing spell work that's backfiring or not working. Somebody's very manipulative. Be careful because somebody's doing this shit every day. Every day, yeah, the Death card. It could be a Scorpio, the Seven of Swords that's very sneaky, underhanded, or a Virgo, or a Pisces, or an Aquarius, or an Aries. It, you pick which side of this you're on. But I see you being in love here. What's the Magician in the reverse? Why is the magician in the reverse with the um with the hermit? Look what that! I can't make it up. The devil. Somebody's doing spell work, just like I said. Okay, I'm sorry that that has to come out a lot in the readings, but it is what it is, man. People on this stupid shit heavy. Okay, so there's a Capricorn or or an Aries that's doing spell work every day. They're doing this. They make it a routine. It is a routine thing of their life is to do spell work on you. OK, it's a routine for them to do this. You understand to stop you page of swords and the seven of swords. I feel like, again, go watch the video I just did of the rumors, lies and, and the hatred video I just posted. This I'm kind of getting this energy here. Somebody page of swords, uh, five of swords. Somebody here. Yeah, this is the five, right? Yeah, this is the five. Somebody here is very jealous of you. They're very hateful. This is somebody that is spreading rumors, lies, gossip about you to get back at you because you are a star, because you have opportunities, because you're, you're in your calling with the judgment. You seem to be very happy. People are very pleased with you, satisfied with you. People seem to give to you. Yeah. Somebody, yeah. Somebody's jealous because you're, you're, you're growing expeditionally. Yes. With the eight of wands and the knight of swords, three of pentacles, nine of cups, you're growing fast. 
like really, really fast. Somebody is sitting back, literally hating on you, jealous. Page of Swords, Five of Swords, somebody hates you. That you have a following, that you're growing, that you're growing really, really fast, that people really, really fuck with you, that you are, that, that you, um, are doing your thing. So there's somebody here that's doing this. This could be someone you have a kid with or children with, with the six of cups. This is definitely someone from your past, but I'm getting with the magician in the reverse. This is somebody that's a con, a liar. Literally, that's what the magician is. A con, a liar, somebody that um does whatever they have to do to win in a situation. They'll lie, they'll gossip or say whatever they have to say to get people to um ride, to ride their coattail or ride with them or get people to view you, the star, in a different way or whatever. And, and, and and all they, all the only type of people they can get to ride with them or believe in what they're saying is stupid motherfuckers just like them. Because I'm getting your work speaks for itself. Who you are speaks for yourself. You're very intelligent, very respected, very much um vibrating, extremely high with the high priestess and the star card. You're an initiate. You seem to have great opportunities. You're also very much protected by your spirit guides. You and a child. I see a woman and a child in this boat. So you and your child are very much protected. I also see you traveling soon here for some of you or you could be planning a trip with the two of wands six of swords or somebody's planning to come and see you somebody that you met somebody that you that you ace of wands is new like just literally met so it's the ace of swords someone's planning to come and see you they want to see you whoever you are if you're a high priestess a psychic in the public eye or an astrologer or whatever this is somebody wants to come and see you then you got somebody mad somewhere spreading rumors a virgo a capricorn a scorpio a aries or something they're mad because you're happy you're doing your thing this is so very positive of controlling and, and, and pathetic as well. Somebody is trying to hold on to you or possess you. Somebody feels like you belong to them. You do fucking not, nigga. The fuck you mean? You dirty rat ass nigga. Yeah, here go the seven of swords. Uh, I'm showing up now. A sneaky, dirty rat motherfucker that can't seem to let go and move on with their raggedy, dirty ass life. They keep trying to trap you stuck keep you stuck, keep you under some kind of spell or they're trying to pull the wool over motherfuckers eyes. This person has been doing spell work on you and you know it with the high priestess ace of swords. You are very clear on who's doing this. This Virgo that's been doing it. This could be somebody in your family with the ten of cups. That's family. You, they've been doing this on you since you were a child. You know this. You know that this Virgo has been trying to do spell work on you as well. Okay. Period. Point blank. You know that this Capricorn, this Virgo, this Scorpio, this Aries, or whoever the fuck it is, or all of these people have been trying to, have been doing spell work on you, or has, um, is doing it currently, period. You know what the fuck is up, and somebody is trying to, to it, make it seem as if you don't, and you very much do, okay? I'm also getting like, somebody's doing spell work, they could be trying to make themselves more attractive, or bulky or make their body look better so that you want them or they could be going to the gym really heavy somebody here is doing some kind of spell work as far as like looks they want you to be attracted to them i'm getting you'll never be attracted to their ugly broke down busted devil devilish demonic ass and there's nothing in the world they could do that no matter amount of spell work in the world will ever make you want they ass you see them as exactly who they are a busted broke down ugly um pathetic demonic demon and that's how you're always going to see them what's the messages or that's how they're always going to see your ass we got the four of pentacles i told you somebody's trying to delay you hold on to you yeah hey man pisces somebody's trying to delay you hold on to you keep you stuck keep you trapped and bound it's like somebody wants you to be trapped they want your hands tied behind your back somebody may even want to kidnap you somebody may want to want to tie you up like this is somebody that doesn't want nobody to be with you they, their spell work isn't working with the magician in reverse so somebody's really they, they, they wish that they could kidnap you i'm getting you try with me ho and i'm gonna blow your motherfucking brains out ho and that's real shit. So whichever, whoever watching this and you think that you motherfucker, you want, you, you want to act like you loped out, bitch. Try it. I fucking dare you. So let's see what the messages are. You want to act like you demonic and slow. You're going to see slow, ho. You're going to slowly see your ass going down to the pits of fucking hell with this devil card when I'm done with you. So you guys make sure that you're protecting yourself because you're dealing with a, a very demonic energy. Somebody here wants to possess, control, and trap, and keep you fucking stuck. Just period. 
They don't want to see you have anything. They want you to be tied to their demonic soul. That is not your motherfucking fortune or future. You're destined to shine, to be a star, to be a healer and make a difference. This person is a loser and they can't seem to get that through their thick, fucking slow mental head. It's a wrap. Yeah, death card. Could be a Scorpio. The Eight of Cups that you walked away from, that you do not deal with, that you want nothing at all, zero zilch ever to do with. They cannot, they don't get it. What's the message here? Four of Pentacles in the hangman. They're in the, in, in, and I'm hearing spirits say their, their spare work is backfiring instantly. Somebody here is going through a string of bad luck, bad news, bad everything. Nothing is moving forward for this fucking clown or any of that. Yeah, the Knight of Swords. Yeah, somebody's really trying to attack you. They're, tr they're really trying to come for you here. They spend a whole lot of time doing this weak ass shit too. What's the Knight of Swords? I'm getting you're still taking off. Yeah, somebody's trying to hold you back and delay you. And look how and look how fast you're taking off with the with the Knight of Swords. In the um uh, right there. You're taking off quick, too fast. They're not delaying, stopping, or holding on to shit, bitch. You already gone, ho. What the fuck is wrong with this stupid ass nigga? We have the Eight of Wands. Look at that. Things taking off for you quick. Somebody's trying to slow you down. You're moving really fast. You're really growing expeditionally and somebody can't stand it yeah the king of swords the queen of wands the three of wands the king of wands you just you 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 seem to have a lot of suitors you're just doing your thing minding your own business living in your north node doing your calling judgment and somebody is just pathetic one, one more for the knight of swords what is this knight of swords what is this knight of swords I'm so tired of, yeah, the Eight of Wands. I'm so tired of, yeah, the King of Swords. You're highly intelligent. You're growing. You're very much respected. You could you could just be too quick. I feel like somebody's trying to delay and stop shit and it ain't working. So I feel like somebody's spiritually attacking you as well. They're very much trying to attack you here. They're spent, they're sending a lot of attacks your way. And I feel like the shit is instantly backfiring on their ass. Yeah, the Eight of Swords and the Eight of Cups. Somebody's trying to keep you from walking away. Somebody's trying to keep you stuck. And I'm getting you're not. You'll never be with this person. You'll never want them. You'll never none of that shit. Somebody's not. Somebody here is getting on my fucking nerves, dog. Just even showing up in our readings. Like, you're a loser. You don't make it a part of the cut hole. You're a loser, bitch. You don't get to rock with the stars. You don't get to rock with and sit at our table hole. You don't get to be that. You're a loser and that's where you're going to be. And no matter uh, no matter how much spell work you try to do, pussy, two, 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 exactly. Two, 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 two. No matter how much spell work you try to do, it'll never work, ho. Never. Give it the fuck up, bitch. Somebody's trying to send every attack that they know towards your way. And, and you just still sitting up here, high priestess, ace of swords, ace of wands, all these opportunities around you, your God, your guides are around you, six of swords, you keep making good choices, you're just doing your thing. Somebody just does not fucking get it. What is the king of swords? Somebody is mad, bitter, angry, upset. They feel that they, they, um, they don't know what to do in their life. They seem to be stuck. Nothing is moving forward for them. What is the eight of wands? And you seem to be taken off very quick. I'm also getting you're learning something or doing something new here. What is the Eight of Wands? Like, it's just not, yeah, the Eight of Pentacles. Somebody's really, you're really taking off really quickly in your work. You're working very hard. I'm getting you're the best at what you do, King of Swords. You're just, it's just like you're, you're growing rapidly here. Like, it's so, it's like fast. And somebody wants to either block or stop or hold you back. And this is a Virgo in your fucking family. Yeah, the Six of Wands. Look at that, the world card. You're becoming world renowned. Very quickly, you're growing. Success, recognition, you are growing quickly. Okay, yeah, Page of Wands and the Justice. You're getting good news. You can expect good news to come in. If this is a court case or a pending court case, you're going to get good news regarding that as well. So, I, I mean, you just can't be stopped. Somebody cannot let go, move on. They're, they're stuck, man. I'm getting your skill. You're the best. The King of Swords is the best is what you do. You're a genius as well. You're a fucking beast. Highly intelligent. King of Swords, Ace of Swords. Too quick for motherfuckers. Somebody didn't realize just how smart and quick your ass is.
So this Virgo or Capricorn, this Scorpio Pisces, or whoever the fuck it is, cause um stop you doing spell work on you. Bitch, you've been doing it all a motherfucking life. The number 24 could be significant. And a bitch know what's up. High priestess ace of swords, stop doing that shit. Because you ain't doing nothing but fucking you up. And 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 and, and a bitch gonna get the front row seat to your shit. So your best bet is to is to ask for repentance, ho, and to move the fuck on. Because this because what you think you're doing, you about to see. And then when you call motherfuckers out and you and, and they want to call you the devil, or you're that's the devil. She do this, she do wicked shit, she do this, that. Then why a bitch so blessed is sitting up so pretty then, ho? Why is a bitch chosen to be in this position if they wicked? No, bitch, it's always you wicked when you find out who the wicked ones is and you call their ass out. They call you wicked, but they the ones behind the scene doing spell work, has been doing it on you for since a child, or, 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 or has been doing it on you recently, or it's different for everybody. They're the ones that's wicked, and I'm the one here to expose it, because I could care less what a motherfucker think about me, bitch. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm part of the royalty, the royals, ho, the elite. You bitches is clowns. What's the messages here? So whoever I'm talking to, bitch, you the shit. And I'm not just saying that. It's right here. And there's a sad ass sorry family members with the Ten of Cups or family member or ex. The ex is here as well. Somebody from the past that can't seem to let it go. Yeah. The higher font, you're very much respected. You're very much in a respected position that God, this is God, the higher font. The Pope that chose you to be in this position with the judgment and motherfuckers is coming. Bitch, please. I'm getting the more these people do this wicked ass shit, the more trapped, stuck, miserable, the more bad karma they bring for themselves and the more you grow exceptionally, expeditionally as well. I'm getting you taken the fuck off. You are so skilled. You are the best king of swords at what you do. The best and very professional as well. What's the messages here? You don't have this type of luck and, and, and this type of shit around you if you if you of wicked. You just don't get to do have that. Your emperor, your boss too. Aries energy. Yeah, we have the nine of swords. We have the queen of pentacles and the four of wands. Yeah, somebody is like, they're, they're, they're worried about you being in a relationship. They're worried about, I feel like there's an Aries too that's a little worried or up at night they want to they want a relationship with you or or something like that somebody I, I don't know yeah but but that's for some of you for others that there's somebody here they're worried they're shook you're taking off your boss you're going to be with this boss motherfucker that's coming in it could be an emperor or a king of pentacles shit it could be a king of swords too you're very nurturing loving i'm getting your business you if you have a spiritual practice i'm getting that's taking off I'm getting you're very successful. You're on stage, Four of Wands. You're very much respected, man. People really fuck with you. I'm getting a lot of emails for your work as well. Yeah, I opened the deck and the Ace of Pentacles is here. And I, another Ace, opportunities are coming in towards you. Yeah, we have this Five of Swords and Page of Swords in the world. Yeah, somebody's just watching you online. Yeah, you get a lot of likes, comments, subscribes. A lot of people commenting you, com complimenting you or liking you. This person reads every comment somebody le leaves for you, man. They're, they're, they're obsessed with your ass. Devil card. Somebody is obsessed with you. And, they, and they're and they spreading rumors and lies. Five of swords and the page of swords because you're sexy, you're winning, you're beautiful. Somebody is just mad. You're mad, ho. Get glad, bitch. Get used to seeing a whole thing because that's, that's what you're going to see now in the future and you're going to die seeing it. You're going to be on your deathbed or in your casket still seeing the bitch win. How about that? All right. I'm also getting that some of you could be getting a new home here as well. Purchasing a new home or a house or something like that. Some of you could be um, into real estate. You could be signing a contract here or making your first deal or something. is just very, a big payout is coming in here. And that's just that the fuck on that. Yeah, the, um, the chariot. I'm definitely seeing somebody. I'm, I'm definitely seeing you meeting somebody. Somebody traveling to see you. I'm getting travel here. Somebody wants to travel to see you. Could be a Cancerian, okay? Yeah, the nine of wands, the fool, the sun. It's just like somebody is just so mad, dog. Because you're free, you're unencumbered, you shine, you're beautiful, okay? You're doing your thing. You're on top of shit. You you ain't hurting for shit. Yeah, the queen of wands, the justice. You're 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 motherfucking um. 
some of you could be Libras. You're the scale. You're the justice. You're very beautiful. You're taking charge. I'm also getting something about someone's breast here. I'm getting a lot of about someone's boobs. Maybe somebody really likes your boobs or something. All right. Anyways. Okay. Yeah. The three of Pentacles. So I'm getting, yeah, definitely career moves. Definitely um, something about your work here is really taking off. A lot of expansion here. Yeah, three of cups. A lot of celebrating the temperance, being very happy here. A lot of success and recognition, maybe even a promotion at work. You're just doing your thing here. Very, very, very happy. Somebody can't let that go. They just can't, they just can't let it go. They just can't understand that their spell work, yeah, justice. And the tower and the four of cups. Yeah, and the queen of swords and the will of fortune. Yeah. Somebody's going to get bad karma here for whatever this is they're attempting to do. And there's that other ace. You almost have every ace out in the deck. You have three here. I really do not have that many cards on this fucking table. Real talk. Okay. I'm getting, I'm getting your, your justice is yours, period. Somebody could want to see you fucked up, but it's not going to work. Somebody trying to cause instability and blocks and that. They just blocking their own damn ass. Somebody here is stupid. They're, they're extremely dumb. What's the magician in the reverse with the devil? The magician in the reverse with the devil? Somebody's a con too. This person know how to con people. They're very good at it. They're very good at it. So it could be a Scorpio uh, an, or an Aquarius or an Aries here. Somebody's a fucking devil. What's the magician in the reverse with the devil? And they do this every day. They've been doing this shit. Yeah, we got the queen of swords here. So it could be a Libran or somebody's doing this to a Libra. Period, point blank. Yeah, somebody tried to cause confusion. Somebody tried to play somebody 50. Like they didn't know what the fuck is up. Yeah, we got the death card. Could be a Scorpio doing this on a Libra or it could be vice versa. Somebody try to motherfucking play somebody like they don't know what the fuck is going on around them. Queen of Swords is highly intelligent. They rule the cerebral cortex. They're geniuses, bitch. They know exactly what's up. And what somebody don't know is somebody plays stupid to one up a dumb motherfucker. Now somebody's stuck looking stupid. Whoever this Virgo is in your family, whoever this Capricorn is, this Aries, this Scorpio, this Pisces, this um fucking who else is here? Aquarius, uh, uh, whoever the fuck it is. Somebody ain't confused. They know exactly what the fuck is up. What's the Queen of Swords? It's like somebody wants you to be confused or that somebody's trying to beguile you or they're trying to make it seem like you don't know what's up. Yeah, the Six of Wands, but you're victorious. Somebody's mad because you're victorious. You have the Six of Pentacles and you're highly gifted. We got three sixes here. I'm getting there's a Libra that's highly gifted, very, very, um, very a, a star, a spiritualist, and a reiki healer, a motherfucking a, a tarot reader, whatever this is, a psychic, growing very fast, a business owner, somebody very abundant, queen of pentacles, somebody that that's running their shit, somebody heavily protected with the six of swords and the judgment. I'm getting you're growing, you're doing your thing, you're being patronized, you're, you're be somebody just mad, man. Yeah, the nine of pentacles, you're self made, self sufficient, you're beautiful, pre empress energy, whoever this is, I'm talking about. Yeah, and I'm getting, yeah, not a ten of pentacles. Absolutely. I'm getting a lot of money is coming in for whoever this is. A lot of money. Good news is coming in here. A lot of donations and patronism. Everything you want. Somebody's mad. Yeah, the sun and the page of wands. I'm getting going to be very happy here with whatever this news is that's coming in. I'm also getting a payout is coming in here. Yeah, the knight of pentacles. I'm getting something that's very steady for you. I'm getting your, 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 you put a lot into something here. I'm getting generational wealth. Not a pinnacles, ten of pinnacles is long money, generational wealth, man. Like you're always going to have it. I open the deck and there's the king of pinnacles. I'm talking about big money. The universe is conspiring to make somebody very, very rich. Okay, period. Because it's their destiny. Star card. What is the king of pentacles? I'm also getting like somebody could have been, yeah, and I'm getting some, I'm getting a lot of streams of income here. Okay. Your finances are balancing out or yeah, we have the nine of cups in the moon. You're getting what you want. Okay. Just period. You're going to have what you want. Just period. Nobody's going to stop that, fuck that up or any of that. Yeah. The page of pentacles, a lot of pentacles here. All right. I feel like somebody may be trying to cause something, but it's not working. Yeah, we have the lover's card. 
in the page of swords five of cups there's somebody sad out bad broke and some old shit that's that's watching you yeah the three like somebody's that somebody is sad heartbroken you block them you don't want anything to do with them at all I feel like you have a king of swords coming in towards you, a king of pentacles coming in towards you, and an emperor. You got nothing but bosses around your ass. That's all you want, and that's all you're going to deal with. Anybody that's not boss can kick fucking rocks and kick it with no socks on, bitch. With the dusty ass motherfucking feet anyways. I would be careful about somebody trying to come in and apologize. Somebody got um, very, very uh, fucked up motives here. I'm getting a lot of pinnacles around somebody. You're single. You're self-sufficient. You could be doing something new. There could be a new job you're doing, bringing in a, a second source of income. You okay? Yeah, the four swords. You're very much at peace. Very unbothered. You, you're very, you're very provided for by the universe. Okay, and somebody doesn't, and somebody doesn't like to see that or doesn't want to know that you have this. It's just as simple as that. But I'm getting the money just keeps coming in. Yeah, the world card and the temperance. All right. Could be dealing with a Sagittarius. And now we have the King of Wands. So there's a King of Wands that's sad to a fire sign. It could be a Leo that's very sad. They're heartbroken. You broke up with them. Yeah. The Empress, the Tower, and the Ace of Cups with the Page of Swords, the Hierophant. Yeah. I'm getting your blocking this fire sign. Okay. There is a king of pentacles coming towards you. Somebody that is, they, they could be moving kind of slow, but they're coming. Okay. They, they are definitely coming here. Okay. Yeah. Somebody here. Um, There's a Scorpio with the tower card here and the ace of cups. There, there's somebody here that's, yeah, the five of wands that's really, and the five of swords that's competing with you, jealous, hateful, angry. They want to see you break up. They want to see you block from somebody. They're competing with this fire sign. They're trying to cause um, everything to fall down with this fire sign. They want to see you cry and sad and lose love and be out but it, and, and be fucked up. But, it's, but I feel like all that shit is backfiring. Instead, this person, this is happening with this person. Yeah, the Ten of Wands and the Justice. And we have another king. So somebody has a lot of options here. And they are kings, not pages, but fucking kings that are coming in here. Somebody's definitely, there's definitely somebody trying hard, man, to, to, to close you off for love or make you cold-hearted to love. I'm getting you're not. You're very much open to love. You very much want love. And you very much have options here in love. And you're very much going to have options in love. Nobody's stopping a motherfucking thing. Just period. I feel like this could also be somebody's ex trying to do spell work. Doing it to keep to to to, to get somebody not to love you or want you or to be or to be attracted to you or to keep them trapped to them. This is just too much. All right. But we have the full card here. All right. So I see you taking a leap of faith. I see you doing something else here. I see you being very happy, very abundant, very well taken care of. You're growing expeditionally. You're taking off in life. Your business is taking off great. You seem to have different opportunities around you. You're very happy here and you keep living your life. Whatever this person is doing, it's not going to work. In fact, it's, it's really, really affecting them bad. It's really, really, really affecting them. I feel like somebody has no love in their life. They have no family. They have no friends. They have nothing. They're losing like a motherfucker. Yeah, the seven of wands, okay? With the seven of wands and the tower, I feel like somebody's shit is just, somebody's shit is backfiring. Real, real bad. What's the seven of wands? What is the seven of wands? Because you have the knight of swords and the eight of wands. Things are moving ahead for you quickly. What is the seven of wands? Before we go. Yeah, the sun card. Someone's trying to block your happiness. That is that 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 is what they're doing. Anything that makes you happy at all. Love, sex, money, or anything. Somebody's is trying to block. But I'm getting it ain't working. Look at this. Four of swords, three of wands, nine of cups. You can expect three of wands is looking towards the future. You can expect to be very happy. Eat good, sleep good. Nine of Cups is making it. That's your wishes. That's genies in a bottle. All your wishes and everything you want will come true. You can rest easy. Four swords. You can sleep and rest easy. Know that your future, you have a bright future with a lot of luck and fortune and fame and everything you want in it. And I'm being so serious here. 
so serious. Somebody else is destined. Wow. Somebody else is destined to the five of pentacles, ten of wands, eight of cups. Somebody's going, somebody's going to get really bad karma. Somebody else is going, I'm getting the tables have turned. Somebody asked, maybe, maybe at one point in your life, you were struggling. You were out bad. You were down. You were in poverty. You wasn't doing well. You turned that whole shit around. Your whole destiny has changed. Now you're a star. You're winning. You have plenty of money. And now somebody else's ass is broke down or they're destined to poverty. They're weighed down, stressed out. Yeah, I feel like somebody is like, and, and this is also karma. Somebody keeps coming for God's chosen child. And, and, they, and this is why they're fucking themselves up. I'm getting a string of bad luck for somebody just back to back to back period but that's not your business so you should give a fuck with somebody try to put out exactly what they deserve to come back on them a hundredfold so rest easy four swords three of wands queen of wands nine of cups you're going to be beautiful you can expect good to come in you can expect to live a very luxurious life be, be a star be very much a healer and influencer somebody that shines and inspires the world and that makes a difference in people's lives this is what you're called to do and you're going to have it and do it by any means. So don't worry about what this fucking loser or these loser motherfuckers in your family or whoever it could be is trying to do. You're going to get to see how they suffer and they're going to watch and see how you win. So those are your messages. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, follow your girl on Instagram at Empress Goddess underscore 35 and on TikTok at Unique underscore Tarot. Bye.